From being wrongly judged at Tottenham to being Newcastle's best signing in years, Kieran Trippier has re-established himself as one of the best right backs in the world. But beyond his storied career, we see a guy whose lifestyle is completely different from what you would ever imagine. His relationship, life outside football, luxuries, net worth, and everything in between, this is the roller coaster lifestyle of Kieran Trippier. Karen John Trippier was born on the 19th of September in 1990 in Barrie, Manchester, to Chris Trippier and Eleanor Lomax. He grew up alongside his three elder brothers in Somerset in Ramsbottom, Greater Manchester, in modest settings. His father, who is of mixed ethnicity, worked as a tree specialist in Scotland and his income was barely enough for the family at the time. Although Trippier picked up football at an early age, it was education first for Trippier's parents, so he attended school until he was almost 17. He, however, played in the school football team, helping them to win a couple of trophies. Trippier's family were all Manchester United fans, and he was scouted by the Red Devils when he was eight. But he chose their fierce rivals, Manchester City, over them because he had a couple of buddies there, which was against his father's wish. Although his parents weren't exactly happy that he chose City, they didn't pressure him either or scold him for his decisions. Trippier started out as a midfielder at City's academy before eventually settling at the right-back position. The headmaster of his school would give Trippier Tuesdays and Thursdays off so that he could train and, looking back, it wasn't a bad thing to do. Trippier progressed through the youth ranks and signed his first professional contract in 2007, the same year that he graduated from Woodhay High School. He then became a regular in the reserve team before having a couple of loan spells at Barnsley and Burnley. The Manchester City takeover just happened and the club owner Sheikh Mansour was looking for more experienced players to help the team compete at the highest level. Having impressed at both clubs, the bigger clubs came calling, and Trippier joined Tottenham in June 2015 for a reported fee of £3.5 million. A year after turning down Arsenal, he would then serve as an understudy to Kyle Walker for the next two seasons. Trippier would then become a regular for Spurs after Walker left for Manchester City, but the following season was extremely disappointing. A series of defensive errors, injuries, and poor form brought an end to his days at Tottenham. Trippier joined Atletico in July 2019 for a fee of £20 million plus add-ons, becoming their first English player in 95 years. That's crazy! But he would finally get his hands on his first major trophy after Atletico won La Liga in the 2020 and 21 season. But despite his success, our boy Trippier was a little homesick and wanted to return to England. He would then join Newcastle midway through the 2021 and 22 season in January. But last season was when Trippier reminded everyone that he was still a big shot. He was in the top three of all players for chances created and crosses delivered and played a huge role in helping Newcastle to a fourth place finish and Champions League qualification. He was subsequently voted the Newcastle player of the season and since then he's been phenomenal for the team. For the most part, even though Newcastle might not be exactly where they want to be at the moment. On the international stage though, Trippier was called up to the senior squad in 2017. He was one of the best performers for the England team at the 2018 World Cup in Russia, creating 24 chances for his teammates, more than any other player at the tournament. Trippier also scored the only goal for England from a brilliant free kick against Croatia in a 2-1 semi-final loss. But since then, he has faced stiff competition from the likes of Kyle Walker and Reese James, but still, Trippier has made almost half a century of appearances for the Three Lions. Known for being vocal on the pitch and for his offensive and defensive contributions, Trippier is quite the defender many fans would want to have on their team. But here's where things get more interesting. Trippier's life away from football. Kieran Trippier married his wife Charlotte in June 2016. The wedding took place in Cyprus and was done in private. The couple have three beautiful kids together. We often see the Trippiers spending quality family time together. They regularly go on vacations to exotic places in the Bahamas, Europe, and other holiday destinations. Trippier revealed that when his son Jacob gets older, he'll put the ball at his feet hoping that he loves it, but if it doesn't work out, no worries. Trippier and his family are very close friends with Harry Kane and we've seen a natural friendship exist between Trippier's son and Kane's daughter. For Charlotte, we know that she's very much into travel and fashion as we can see from her Instagram page. She has embraced the city life at Tyneside as well. Apart from being with his family, Trippier spends his free time playing golf and watching movies. We also know that he's a sucker for tattoos. Trippier's arms and chest are fully covered with tattoos. On his right arm, you'll find a lot of flower tattoos and a picture of a woman. 
On the left arm, there are faces, roses, and a freedom pigeon tattoo. We've seen the defender proudly showing off his tats on numerous occasions, and we also know that he has one as a tribute to his mother. While at Atletico Madrid, we saw Trippier embrace the Spanish culture quickly by learning the language and taking some liking to the Spanish lifestyle. Following his move to St. James's Park, Trippier found a mansion at Tyneside. Although the full details about the house remain undisclosed, we've seen snippets from Charlotte on her Instagram showing one of the regular makeovers she does in the house. Moving over to his garage, we see a Lamborghini Huracan with Nero Aldebaran paint and 21-inch alloy wheels. The vehicle's 5.2-liter V10 engine produces 580 horsepower when made it to a 7-speed transmission. The Lambo is rumored to have cost him over $200,000. Trippier also has a Mercedes-Benz V-Class with a 2.2-liter four-cylinder V-Class, 161 horsepower, and 380 newton meters of torque, which is said to have cost him 80 grand. And then we have a matte black Range Rover autobiography that costs $140,000. The 5.0 liter supercharged V8 engine produces 510 horsepower and is mated to an eight-speed automatic transmission that powers the vehicle. So with all these under his possession, just how much is Kieran Trippier worth? Trippier may be underrated on the field, but certainly not when it comes to finances. Earning 120,000 pounds weekly, Trippier is the second highest earner at Newcastle, only behind Bruno Guimaraes, who earns 160,000 pounds. This brings Trippier's annual salary to more than 6 million pounds. Considering the fact that his earnings were nothing to scoff at at Tottenham and Atletico, and the fact that he has endorsement deals with Adidas and other high-profile brands, we expect Trippier's net worth to be around the ballpark of $40 million. The Defender is also known for his charitable work and has been involved in several initiatives aimed at helping disadvantaged children and communities. Trippier has also been vocal about his support for mental health awareness and has made efforts to raise both awareness and funds for mental health charities. Still, he has found himself in hot water at times. Going into 2021, Trippier was served a 10-week worldwide football ban and fined 70,000 pounds for four breaches of football association betting rules. The incident occurred after Trippier allegedly passed on information on his transfer to his friends, who then cashed out of the situation by placing bets on his transfer. From there, we saw some back and forth, but at the end of the day, Trippier sat out his ban before returning to play for his team in March. We also saw the defender being called out by some fans who accused the England right back of moving to St. James's Park in a 12 million pound deal from Atletico Madrid simply because of the money. Although Trippier has repeatedly stated that he is not at St. James's Park for the money, some fans still have a hard time believing him. Now 33 years old, Trippier only has a few years left to compete at the highest level. For a major part of his career, the right back flew under the publicity radar, was easily let go by Tottenham, and had to reinvent himself to remind everyone of his quality. Now reaping the benefits of his hard work, we can only imagine how far he'll go with Newcastle.